and welcome back to MVM Live. I am here today with uh, Kira, and I am Ryan, and we are bringing you a game we're really excited about. So this is Wingspan. We've only all been playing it about a thousand times. I think Jeremy's played it, what, like 500 now? I can't even, I have no idea how many times Jeremy's played it. It's, <laughs> an, it's an obscene amount of times, but this is probably one of the hottest games out yeah, right now. it is. I got really lucky. I caught uh, Meeple Source was doing pre-orders. And I ordered two, one for us and one to give away today. So we'll be giving away a copy of Wingspan. Um, we also have some very exciting custom bits that I ordered for myself. Yeah. And some that we were donated from Top Shelf Gamer, which I'm going to start with because th this particular component is also going to be given away with our copy of Wingspan. Today, yeah, that's right. Which are these wonderful little nests to hold your eggs in. Um, yeah, so we have a really... Yeah, this, this is the great. this is the episode to watch because we have a this is a really cool giveaway because you're not just gonna win wingspan if you win you you're win the nests blinged out set of nests as well so and and they've also kindly donated uh, a set of card sleeves for the game as well that's right which so is you're, great you're getting a whole you're gonna come out of the gate with an already blinged out set of wingspan which is pretty yes. cool now I'm a let's jealous. talk about my blinged out set of wingspan because I've gone a little bit because I ordered mine from Meeple Source yeah. I got the custom resource bits which you'll see us playing with here in just a moment. And I'm really excited because I went on Etsy. Jeremy had ordered himself some birdhouses that were really, really cool on Etsy. And I went on to find them and I found there was another company doing really cool birdhouses. And I reached out and he made sure that we had these in time for the live stream so I could show yeah. you guys how cool they are. I got my little blue one right here. And um, if you check out our Instagram, I have tagged... Uh, so man versus meeple on Instagram. I have tagged his store all the stores for all of our custom components today So you guys can check them out pretty easily um, Yeah, you know what, yeah. I, what I really appreciate about these birdhouses is that they're not just different colors for the player I color know. They're actually different shapes yeah, of different look. types of birdhouses. So this one's all that's just a lot of thought that went into it Yeah, so it's a little hard to see but go to our Instagram account check them out and definitely um, They just add a little more whimsy to the game I'm not definitely whimsy. I, I love the whimsy. So we are going to get to playing Wingspan. Yeah. Before we get started, we just want to give a quick shout out yes. and a quick thank you to Game Toppers for um, sponsoring our show, giving us a great table, and we want to go over our winners from last couple of weeks. So congratulations to Don Lyles for winning Glenmore 2. So yeah, congrats. congratulations, Don. I know you're out there watching somewhere at some point. Um, so just give us an email. If you see your name on this list, hit us up at uh, man versus meeple at gmail.com yep. and we will get you taken care of and all you have to do today is comment be active on the stream and you will be entered to win our blinged out wingspan yes and f i see a couple questions about how to win this game uh it is just make a comment and we use a random number generator uh based on the length of the stream yep. to figure out where to look for the winner and then another random ge number generator there so it's very much very random how we choose our winner winners. We gotta make sure everybody has a good chance. So make sure you're commenting if you're watching, if you are looking to win a copy of this very highly sought after game right now, Wingspan. So we're yeah. gonna get to playing. Yeah, and we so the game is already kind of set up. Now, some of this stuff does come with the game originally. So all these boards and everything, these um, cool eggs, like these eggs are part of the game. So you might think that we bling these eggs out, but we didn't. Now, these nests are special, but the birdhouse comes with the game, the dice. Uh, we are using some blinged out resources. Well, though. but these little trays yeah. from game trays came with the That's game. That's true. The trays did. We just filled them up with little wooden components. Normally you have um, cardboard chits, but we have little wooden <laughs> varieties of these games that you are uh, resources that you can see here that we're going to use today. Yeah. So thank you, Kira, for. Yeah, I brought all my. I really love. Cool if, you have, if you watch our chit chat program, we had our last episode was completely dedicated to. Wasn't it the last episode? It might have been, I think two episodes ago now at this point. I don't one know. One of the recent one episodes. The recent I ones. think it was the last one. It's we were all talking track. about our favorite components. And so uh, these are now some of my favorite components, especially these wonderful little birdhouses. So um, definitely love all of the stuff. But yeah, Jamie and Stonemare did a really great oh, job making all the custom job. components the way we like them to begin with. And, um, and this game is just so well produced in the first place. Yeah, so. it's beautiful. So let's get to playing. All right, for those of you who don't know what Wingspan is, Kier and I are bird enthusiasts with our own bird sanctuaries. And if you look at uh, the boards here in front of us, you'll notice that our sanctuary is broken down into three types of terrain. The forests, the grasslands, and the wetlands. And we are trying to bring in birds to our sanctuary to kind of protect them and take care of them and, and things like that. Yep. 
really what we're doing <laughs> is building an engine. We're getting the best <laughs> birds to fill our engine and, and allow us to do those things. So we're going to kind of jump in and maybe ex explain some things as we as we go. But what you want to know that we're doing right now is looking through our hand of five bird cards and two in-game objectives. And we're choosing one of these objectives to keep and as many of these bird cards as we want. To I'm going to show the objectives on the bigger screen because they're green, so they disappear with our oh, green screen. Oops. So you could see they're a little different on the background with the leaves. Yep. We'll pick one of these at the beginning of the game, which is now. I've already chosen mine, I've so I'll discard mine. I'm discarding. my extra. And then of our five bird cards, which you see our feathers on the back, um, we're going to choose as many of these as we like, and then we're going to choose uh, for every, every one we choose to keep, we'll get rid of a resource. And so I'm going to keep three. I'm going to discard these two. If you can put those in the discard for me, please, Ryan. I'm going to keep two, actually. Now, because I don't want to discard too many resources. So I only have to get rid of two resources. So I definitely want to keep these. But we can get rid of the, the, the worm and the fish for right now. That's OK. So I don't need the worm and the fish. And we've already also predetermined that Kira is going to be the start player. I am. And so uh, let's see, what do I want to do? So we've got some birds out already. I think I'm just going to get started with um, playing a bird. Yeah. And this is a complete point salad style game. So we're just trying to complete the most points as possible. Actually, birds are going to have points. No. Uh, our objective cards is okay, going to give you food. points. And we have this little score scoreboard right here in the middle that is going to give you different points for objectives each round. So our round one objective is actually to have the most eggs on birds and forests. Yep. So if you see us going for that, that's why. So first thing I'm going to do is uh, play a bird. So I'll put my little thing up here. I gained food. Let's spend the wee, and I'm gonna put out a morning dove. What a cute little bird. Not worth any victory points for me, but. Holds a lot of eggs. It does hold, that's it. Lots of eggs, but that nest is not one of the nests I, in the You gold, know what, so. I do know that, but. Uh, but, but it's okay, I'm gonna play a bird. I'm going to play my, game, no my pick me nut hatch uh -huh. uh, that when activated, I'm going to be able to tuck a card from behind my from my hand behind this bird and then gain a worm or a wheat from the supply, not to cash on the card. We will be able to cash things on the card. We'll be able to tuck cards. Those are all parts of that engine build. I need to pay a worm and a wheat for that guy. And I don't see any cup birds available either, which is very sad. Also, the resources I need to play my bird are not available, so I'm going to have to, I'm going to just gain resources anyway because you can use resources as kind of as wild. So I'm going to get one die worth. Let's take, let's take a little slug out here. That's what I'm. That's all. One action per. I say worm, you say slug. They're actually worm. we're using the wrong terminology, but I like invertebrates. Is I think they're invertebrates. Yeah. Officially. So called. I I like calling them little wormies. So I'm gonna little call them wormies. little wormies. I can call them little wormies for the stream. Yeah, sure. Why not? I'm gonna play a bird. I'm gonna play my northern harrier. Uh, when activated, I can look at a card from the deck, and if it's less than 75 centimeter wingspan, which you'll see oh, is at the it. bottom of the cards. Well, you won't see perfectly well because it's tiny for you. <laughs> But we'll let you know what we find. I have to pay a little rat to, put to my bring egg. him Every out. time I activate this row, Ooh, I get to put an egg on When my you bird. gain food. Yeah, because I'm going to need it. Because I'm going to. started by playing a bird. I'm going to play another bird. got to make sure he doesn't bird. cheat, remember. Just, you keep, watch my board. If, if Jamie's here, I don't know who's here from Stonemeyer, but you can watch my board. Anyway. I think so Jamie is on a live Jamie stream might be right doing now, his too. Own thing. Um, so he's I'm probably play too busy. This bird. Now, since I played in the second row, it cost me an egg, so this egg goes away. And one of these little mice, rodents, and I'm going to use my cash in of two of anything for the other one because I don't have two rodents. So Sure, sure. That's it for me. All right, I'm going to go ahead and gain. And when this guy's played, he gives me two bonus cards, Food. and I get to keep one of them. No, I'm not. I'm going to draw, I'm going to draw a bird card. I'm just going to draw any old bird card. Just any old bird card. And huh? then um, I only get to draw one right now, so we're going to go ahead and refill that. Ryan, if you can help me refill yep. the row. Thank you. And now it goes back to you. Interesting. I kind of like that bird right there. I'm going to draw bird cards. I only get one, but I'm going to take that new one that you just put okay, out. Okay. There you go. You'll need to give me one to refill. Thank you. Thank you. I kind of like this mountain chickadee. You're being chickadee. awful polite today. I am being very polite. Give me that bird. No, I'm it's being very polite. It's just funny because uh, I was just at Gamma and uh, 
friend of the show, I guess, watches the stream. Yeah. One of the re- it was at the retailer summit and <laughs> called me out for liking mean games and beating up on you on the That's, stream. You so. do enjoy that. This game is not super mean. I think part of the reason is this game is like very calming. Do you notice my voice is a right? Lot more I feel today? like we should be like on NPR. Hi. Today we're playing Wingspan. I have a spotted owl <laughs> in the natural habitat. <laughs> Look at these lovely little birdhouses. This game is just very relaxing to play. It I think is. That's part of the draw. And it is. Uh, I, this is a game that I don't mind losing. Oh, you've already gone four times. I've gone four I times. I have. So it's my turn. It's, no, it's your turn. It's your my turn player. again. I was too busy too invoking... Busy um, invoking your, your public What's his radio? name? Ezra something or something? I'm All right. Somebody in the comments I'm going to gain food. I'm going mm, to gain a little yeah. wormy because I love the little wormies. And then I'm going to tuck a card... <laughs> <laughs> the little wormies. The little wormies. I'm going to tuck a card to gain I like it, honestly. a wheat. I'm going to gain a wheat. A wheat. All right. Wheat. Here's what I'm... Man, I don't know why. I'm not doing this on purpose. Wheat. <laughs> wheat. So I'm going to gain food again. And I'm going to get... Uh, so I get two food. So this is interesting what's going to happen here because I'm going to take one. I'm going to take a fish. And now that there is just one type of resource left in the bird feeder, I'm gonna, I get to reroll all of them. Even if there were two or three dice, if they were all the same. All right. And now, we're rolling into the tray for the purposes of the stream, but this is actually a lovely little, I'm going to pick it up so everybody can yeah, see. Yeah, it is. Dice tray, for those of you who don't know, and you're going to roll. Oh, it's kind of green, so it's disappearing on me. But you're going <laughs> to roll through the back of the birdhouse, and it's going to come out the front it's of a the birdhouse. And it's really lovely. It is lovely, but it's just difficult to use in the stream because you're, you're supposed to be passing this thing around a lot, and we're just kind of keeping it straight. So I'm going to take this... Little wormy. Sorry, little that's what wormy. we're calling them. Now they're wormies. Little wormies. And then mm, when I activate this game. row, this bird gets a egg. So I'm gonna he's gonna get that egg back. Eggs are valuable. They're worth points at the end of the game, but you have to spend them to get into these higher rows. For sure. All right. I'm going to play a bird. I'm gonna play a bird to the water. Ooh. Or wetlands, my wetlands. apologies. You're you're diversifying. For some I reason am. I'm like going heavy. Well, I'll tell you why. Heavy forest Part here. of my strategy here because oh, I didn't tell. get you drawn tell. what I would have liked to to start a little bit more of a serious engine. I need to be able to gain more resources and eggs and things at an easier rate. And by letting uh, filling up these first spaces, it gives me the option to pay a card, a resource, or an egg in order to gain an extra of That's those true. items for my next play of those items. All right, I'm going to play a bird, and he's going to go up here in the forest again. I'm not. I just realized that all these birds I took all were forests. So. This morning dove egg is going away to pay for the cost here, and he's coming into play, and we're just chilling. Yeah, you are definitely working towards the first goal. I am not. Yeah, um, but the first okay. goal is only worth four points, and the last goal is worth seven. So really, I I'm should be working eggs. towards that last goal. I can lay two eggs, and I can pay a resource to lay three, a third egg, and I will. So I'm gonna. I'm just gonna lay one on each each guy for right now. Well, no, I'm gonna lay two on this guy right. for now. I'm going to activate a food again because I need food badly. So first thing I'm gonna do is get my food. Let's get a wheat and a little wormy little because worm. I already have the fish. So let's do that. And then when activated, gain one wheat from the supply and place it on this bird. What this is doing is just scoring me victory points for the end of the game. I'm gonna get victory points for every resource and Indeed. then put another egg here, so. I'm gonna go ahead and draw bird cards. I'm gonna spend one egg so that I can get two. Uh, I'm going to pull, um, sure, I'm going to take this one and this one, okay. I need to not be short. I will refresh the, right? It does help to have long arms, I'll say that, yeah. any kind of game like this. Alright, All right, and then I only have one action left, so what do I want to do? I need to get bird last cards action. too. I know, this is my last action. I need cups, so let's go for this little cup here. I only get one card, so I'm going to deal with it. All right, so that's the end of the round. We've used all of our birdhouses. We have, so now we'll look and see who has the most. That would be Ryan. I have w with one, so no, you have it's, none. It's, oh, it's eggs, and it's I was eggs. thinking it was birds in forests, but oops. It's eggs in forests. I, I had an egg, egg there, and I just spent that egg. Oh, did you? Yeah, I did, because oh, I thought no. it was birds in forests. It's I'm eggs I'm not going to cheat, though. Um, this so is I just eggs don't score. It's okay. It's only, one point, it's only one point difference for the first round. It is only one so point So it's difference. not huge. Between first and last is only one point. Yeah. 
Um, so we're going to go to the next round. So basically, we play the same kind of round. We pull all of our birdhouses back, except we have one less because we just used one up here. Indeed. So the game gets kind of, you start to run out of actions. So now you're the first now player. I'm the first player. I got to think this through about what I want to do because what I really need are cherries and I haven't seen many cherries. So that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. So I'm going to pay this uh, little wormy and then do the, <laughs> the cash in of the wild. So here's the little worm and then these two are going to make a cherry for me so that I could put this bird right here. The northern mockingbird, which I love so I, all these birds. We're getting a lot of comments about like player counts and stuff. I love the set too because it's quick. Um, I've played it primarily at two players so far. Uh, higher player counts is still really lovely. Yeah, it's not a long game. Uh, it's not a long game at all. It uh, definitely changes the dynamics of things because there are a lot of cards that will um, key off other people's cards. That's right. And so it gives you a little bit more options there, uh, or a few more options there. But overall, I'd say any player counts really wonderful. Yeah, there's there's even haven't. a solo, which I haven't tried yet, but I was looking no, at it No, but I did night. play with somebody that has played a lot solo. He said that the solo mode is very good, yeah. especially for learning the game. He said yeah. he, he like thought it was a great experience. So. Super. I haven't tried it yet. Um, I'm going to... Yeah, what are you going to do? I put, actually, this is my first two player game. I'm going to draw. I like how quick it is back and forth. Though. Two cards. I'll spend an egg to draw two cards. Ooh. Um, and then I get to draw two. If I do, um, hold on. No, you don't so want first that guy. I'm going to. It's a puffin. He is cute. He's a big guy, isn't he? I'm going to go and take both of these two cards. Not all these birds are worth the same amount of points, I'm obviously. I'm going to draw two off the deck, and then two I get to discard. Two more off the deck? You get four because, cards? Because of this. But I have to get rid of one. Dang. Ooh, ah. I already kind of have you, don't I? I don't know. Um, and then we will refill yeah, those slots. I'm gonna, so. I'll discard this one. Here, or to, you know, trade you. Uh, what you get did rid we, of? Did a we hawk? kill the row at the end? We were supposed to kill the oh, row at the end, well, so I don't know that I could have even. It's fine. We'll skip it for this time. You normally kill the row at the end of the round, so I can't really forgive us for failing uh, on that. I'm sure that it's, it's fine. I mean, we didn't uh, really mess with the row too much. So, yeah, so I've got. Uh, all of those things, and that's great. I don't have any bir birds in my hand, so I need to draw birds, and I only can get one. I really, what I need to do is put some birds in the water. And which bird do oh, I want to put in the water? Oh, and I was supposed to do that too, and I forgot. I want to put this bird in the water, but he's expensive. Give me a give me a card off top deck. I'm going to do that because I forgot when I okay, laid eggs. Okay, that's fine. And it's not big enough anyway, but okay. at least I feel better about myself. I get it. It's one of those activated power gamble yeah. powers, basically, right? Yes. All right, so I have my bird. Unfortunately, I don't have what I need to feed him, but it's fine. All right, so now I'm going to need to gain some food. I've got all these birds. I need to gain some food, too. I am out. I'm not food. in a great situation, actually. Here. I'm going to pay a card to gain additional food. I'm going to spin that card. Okay. I'm going to gain a Dsfishi. Get the fish. And, and then, then are you going to choose the reroll, or do you want the little Let's go ahead. Let's reroll everything. Reroll all of it. Let's see what we get here. Oh my gosh. Ooh, ooh hi, stuff Dang. and things. Um, I'm just having no luck. I'm gonna today. go ahead and get this other fish. Alright, those are your two. Those are my two, but I can tuck a card from behind from the thing to the thing. And if I do, I can gain a worm or a wheat from the supply. Ooh, what do that's I want? Nice. I think I want a wheat. I oh. need more cards Wheat. because I don't have many. So I'm just going to keep trying to get cards. So I am at a disadvantage with cards since I can only get um, one at a time. But that's fine. I'll make do. I'm going to take this guy. Matt, I think I'll win too. I, probably. I have I've never won this game. I, so. have, I know. I can't let that streak be ruined. <laughs> I'm a little nervous because I just taught my husband as after my copy arrived and he won the last two games. Uh-oh. So, and he won very well. He picked it up very quickly. So we'll see. Um, oh, shoot. What do I want to do now? I know. I know. I am like, I'm in trouble. I don't have any resources. I don't have great cards in my hand. I'm going to go ahead and, oh, gosh, I don't know. So <laughs> what I did, what screwed me up is I went after my objectives. I didn't necessarily look at what habitats these birds went into. Uh -huh. So... So I'm going to gain food again. I'm going to gain this worm. Oh, thank you. 
And then I'm going to yes. play a card to gain another one. Or am I? Yes. Yes, you are. Am you I? You want to take that mouse so that I can reroll all the dice. That's what I you don't want to do, do that. That isn't what you want to do. I'm going to, because I don't need the mouse. Well, sh sure. So I will, I don't want to help you. <laughs> so I will instead just tuck. Tuck it under? That's your guy's ability? Yep. Yeah. No, it's valuable when you can tuck it under instead. Oh, wait, I already did that. Oh, you, did you already do one? Yeah, you Rewind. did. Rewind. I did, yeah. So yeah. here, that's what I was doing. Discarding, and I will gain no. the sweet. Fine. I see how it is. All right. I'm going to still gain food anyway because I have none. So I don't even have anything to work with. I'm going to get two. Well, let's start with the uh, the rodent, I guess, because now I can reroll all the dice. I really don't want that wheat. That wheat's Aww, not... Oh, you no. just made a mess. I did make a mess. That wheat's not good for me. But that cherry is. I get two. Oh, I need that cherry. I can delete. I need that cherry. You can delete. delete. I can discard a card <laughs> to take three. Delete. Deleted. What do I want? Or do I want to take this? There's no fish. Or there's a slug though. Let's take a little wormy. Ugh. I don't feel bad about that. I don't feel good about that decision. I'm not going to discard a card. Okay. I don't feel good about this. I'm going to. In fact, I feel pretty bad about gain it. Gain food. I'm going to gain the cherry. And I'm not going to yeah. tuck this time or discard. I'm I really gonna keep wanted what I that have. cherry, but it just didn't work out for me. Yep. All right, you're done? Yep. I'm playing a bird because I need to get a bird down here. I have to have one. So this is going to cost me that little wormy I just got. And now he's going to sit down here, the green heron, back in the wetlands where he belongs. All right, I'm going to play a bird. It's about time. I'm gonna play my yellow yeah, bellied sapsucker. Yeah, you have a lot more sucker. birds than you do. Ooh, yellow, yellow bellied, bellied sapsucker. Sap Those things are cool. We have those around here, actually. Uh, and when he activates, he'll gain me a worm. Him. Ooh, a worm. Oh, uh, whenever he activates. Activates. All right, great. So I've just got I've got one thing left. So I need to I need to lay some eggs. Is what I need to do actually. Um, but I don't have any. This is too bad. So I'm gonna grab some eggs because we're running out of time here. So I'm gonna put two eggs on this bird. Now his power lets me use another bird in the same habitat as him, which I have none. Oh, so my turn? So very unfortunate, yes. I'm going to lay eggs. I'm gonna lay three eggs and pay that wheat so I can pay, lay that third mm -hmm. egg. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna lay one, two, three. So you've got, or I at least have enough to guarantee that I'm going to be in second place, so that's fine. So let's go for some. Let's go for food. Yeah, let's go for food because I like it. Oh, I just got food, didn't I? No, that was earlier. So I'm doing it again. So I'm going to get the wheat on here, and I'm going to get the egg on here, and I'm going to take something. Definitely take this little worm, and then I guess I'm going to take the wheat. So that's not exactly what I wanted, but <laughs> it's fun. Are people making fun of how terrible I'm doing? Because no, I'm doing really bad. People are relating to you, but I saw someone say Good, oh, thank you. something about an expansion coming at the end of the year. Wait, what? For this, which would be great. Somebody said there's uh, Somebody thinks is, there is. I don't uh, actually know, but I'll tell you what well, I really do like is that someone called it a wing expansion. I'm using that. Thanks for coining that term. Uh, All right, so you have one more action. I do. A wing expansion. A wing expansion. That is the best. I'm going to go ahead and uh, gain food, and I don't like what's in the bird feeder. I don't like what's in the bird feeder at all, actually. And so, I'm going to gain this why fish. Cannot we, why can we not get cherries? That is my and question. And I have the ability to gain a second one now, so I'm going to go ahead and gain yep. this wheat. And then I get to gain a worm because of my guy, and if I want, I can tuck. I'm not going to. All right. So that's the end of the round. So you're right. We have to wipe that, which we didn't do last time. That was our bad. And then we look at bye most bye, eggs in these cup-shaped nests. I have two. I have four. You have four. So you're uh, going to definitely take that I need three new cards. Position. All right. And you're going to be first player now. Is that correct? Yes. Because I'm first player currently. What is our goal here? Most birds in the grasslands. Here. Want well, to help me put these out? Did you just, did you oh. just lift them in your hand? <laughs> I are said, oh, these are for those, me. Are you stealing my birds? I was looking at them. 
All right. All right. So ooh, we have so few actions to spend now. It's it's getting really tight. Okay. All right. Um. All right. Let's see. I would like to play a bird. I'm going to play my Atlantic Puffin Ooh. for three fishy and one egg. Two, whoops, eggs are over here. And when played, I get to draw two new bonus cards. Ryan, can you help me two out, Two new please? bonus cards, wow. I know, it's crazy. What do I have, fish? I don't even have fish. I have nothing over there I can get. You know what? I can get one thing. I'm going to get some birds. So I'm going to draw some bird cards. I'm going to take this guy here. And then let's just go on a gamble. How about oh. hmm. How about I take one from the top as my second one and just hope it's something I can use. That wasn't so bad actually. All right, I'm going to draw birds. This wasn't so bad. I'm going to draw this bird mm. and one from the top, please, okay. sir. There's one from the top and then your replacement bird is right here. Excellent. Oh, what is that? A pretty American bird. American goldfinch. I know. Right. I love that all these birds are, they're all unique birds, if you couldn't tell from us playing. So, I have to play this. I don't know if my wife is, is watching upstairs while she watches our baby, but I'm going to play the American kestrel, which is her favorite bird of all time. This is in honor of her, wherever she is watching from right now. So, put down the American kestrel. It's going to cost me an egg, so I'll pay the egg. Egg. And he's going to sit right here. Okay. All right. I'm going to play a bird. I'm going to pay two wheat and an egg and play this Inca dove. Ink dove? Inca dove. Ooh. When played, lay one egg on each of your birds with that kind of nest. I like that. How many of those kind have... do you have? Okay. I was afraid I was going to see like six eggs come out on I, the board right yeah, now. Yeah, you know, it would have been cool, but that's not the case. <laughs> it would have been really cool. All right. I'm going to gain food. So... First thing I'm going to do is take the, the little rodent because this is going to let me reroll everything and hope to get some cherries. Cherries. One cherry. I'll take Dang, it. One cherry. I'll take the cherry. Then the question is, do I want to discard a card to do it again? And the answer is, yes, I do. I'm also going to take a, a, little, wor a little wormy. I almost keep calling it a slug. It's so when okay, I do that, this guy gets one of these. This guy gets an egg. All right, I'm going to draw bird cards. I'm going to draw this bird. Uh, and one off the top, please. And then we'll need one to refill the row. All right, one off the top. Right. One to refill the row. Dude, there it is. Big time here. Oh, right. turkey vulture doesn't cost any resources to play. Yeah. I'm going to draw some bird cards. I'm going to take that turkey vulture. And I'm not going to discard an egg to take another one. I'm going to gain food. I'm going to gain these two wheat. Uh, wheat and wheat. Ah, wheat, wheat, wheat. Got All it. right, perfect. Um, I like. That. Uh, are you done? I I I have to do this. I get warm, and I can tuck, and I will, and gain. Well, you got a lot of points tucked under that card right now. A worm. No, Dang. wheat. Okay. Man. All right. I'm going to uh, lay eggs. So first of all, I get three eggs to lay. So I'm going to lay one, two, ah. three. Ah. Let's go with one, two, three. Kind of spread them out a little bit. And then I get to activate this power. Now, when activated, I roll all the dice not currently in the bird feeder. If any of these roll rat or rodents, I get a rodent. Roll so rats. <laughs> let's see if you can. S if I roll a rodent here, I did. Oh, lucky duck. And then this one lets me repeat it. So I'm going to do it again. Oh. So the other night, I I feel like rats. I ne I always get the one with the gets you to roll the rats. I did not roll it this and time. And I almost never so. get rats. And the other night, I was playing with Chris. and You got a bunch? I got like six rats on my card that night, which was nuts. It was like a whole, it was just infested with rats. All right, I'm going to play a bird. You know, I don't remember if I played the egg when I played the kestrel. Do it. Do it. I think I did. I trust you. But... I'd rather cheat on the side of, uh, of losing resources play than, an egg. than the other way. Or play a bird and spend an I'm gonna egg and two I'm going to watch this back later. I'm going to say, I paid two eggs for that kestrel. And by one when point. played, gain three from the supply. Oh so I paid gosh. two. Okay, your engine is going really well it right is. now. It is. I'm very happy. All right, so I'm that last action? Yep. All right. Well, I'm going to make sure. Okay, I'm going to play a bird. I'm going to play it here. It's going to cost me an egg. And again, I get this uh, wormy and a cherry. And then I'm going to have to use my... Wait. New eggs? 
New eggs. Oh, what? we've got to go look at Jamie's Facebook. Apparently, new he eggs. said something about new eggs on Facebook. Y'all, well, after the stream, we'll go. After we'll the stream, all go over we're all gonna go and we're gonna go to Jamie on Facebook yes. to see more. I can't. I missed it. So um, that's exciting, though. That Gosh, is exciting. I love. I mean, what like this game is so replayable already. <laughs> right, we, but <laughs> so, we could always use more. Like, content. More stuff is not gonna hurt it at all. I refill this, but we're about to wipe it actually because that was the end of the that round. Was the end so round, those so you'll three wipe go away. All three, I'll get them. You got them. Yep, mostly. Mostly. So those three go yeah. away, and we're gonna get three new birds to replace them. So one. Two, Accidental three. bird puns. I did say lucky duck, didn't I? Oh my gosh. All right. All right. And then I have three birds in the wetland or, wi or wildlands or grasslands so or whatever kind of lands. So we tie. These are the grasslands. Good. The grasslands. The grasslands. All I feel right. like this is like a Lion King thing. All right. All right. All right. All right. So now you're first to start. Is that right? Nope, you are. Oh, I am. And I only have. Five actions. This, this is the is last round. We want eggs in the type of nest. The type I don't of even nest have. That has a bunch of, I don't have it either. Uh oh. Ooh. The race is on. He's gonna go after that bird that I want already. I'm gonna take this one. Okay. Right. Cool. So you drew because, bird cards. And I'm going to spend an egg to take a second one. Oh, you jerk! Refill it. Well. What do we get? It had the kind of eggs Not that, that I, I needed wanted. it. Needed it to have. So. But I have no food. So I'm going to play a bird. This is the last round already. Man, this game is so tight. Like, it's just like. It is. You, you start to get something going and then realize. Oh, wait. It's the end of the game. I have to pay two eggs for this guy. All and right. when played, play a second bird. I don't have a second bird to play. So. But you're that's gonna be okay. able to put a ton of eggs out. So I am gonna good. be able to put a ton of eggs out. I need to gain food because I don't have any. So do I want that slug? Actually, I do want that little wormy. So I'm gonna take the little wormy and then reroll everything for my second pick. I want what's not there. Oh, now I get the cherries. But what I really oh, wanted yeah. was a fish. Frustrating. To give it away to everyone and I didn't get that fish. So let's just go for a wheat here. This will kind of set me up for my next play. All right, that's me. All right, I'm going to lay eggs. Mm. I'm going to lay four eggs. Mm. And those four eggs are going to go places I don't... I have nothing I can do here. I need more birds. Um, yeah, exactly. I'm going to go ahead and put all these guys here. And then when activated, give me one from the top of the deck, please. Okay. And you are... Did you get it? If it's less than 75 centimeters, tuck it. Yeah, because he can eat it. He's 25 centimeters? Yeah, he's less than 75. He's only 25. So, yes. And so, what sucks, though, is he was the kind of nest I needed. <laughs> All right, I'm going to play a bird here um, for one wheat and two eggs. And he says, play a second bird in your this habitat at the normal cost, which for this guy, the normal cost is just two eggs. Cool. I'm gonna yeah. draw birds. Can I take two off the top? Please? You can take two off the top. That makes it easier. Give me one from each me. stack. Oh, one from each stack. Yeah, just to we're mix playing it up. the odds here a little playing bit. The odds. This is like Vegas. Dang, not what Dang. I needed. That's all right. We'll it's live. Okay, so I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna put some eggs out. I'm gonna put out five eggs because I'm going to spend a resource to do so. So let's put out five eggs. All right, one, sure, two. Three, so you know I'm not cheating. Mm -hmm. uh, four, definitely, and five. All right, so I get some abilities. Now, these are both going to repeat the brown powers of this guy. So I have to roll, roll a rodent on this die. Did not do it. I get to try again. Did not do it the second time. So no free rodents for me, unfortunately. I really wasted these guys by putting them here, but, man, I had to put them where I needed them at that time, you know? I'm going to play a bird for a worm. And I'm going to pay two eggs to bring him out. Okay. Yep. All right. I'm going to Last thing. play eggs. Uh, I have two left. Yeah. I'm just, yeah. Oh. Well, that doesn't make any sense, right? I've only played three things. I don't know. I played a bird. There you go. I forgot to put it up Cheater. there. Not cheating. I just forgot to put it up there. All right. Two, three, four, five. All right. I'm going to put four eggs down. Um, let's go with... Are you remembering to do all these? 
All the abilities? Yeah. Yeah, like that's why I've been rolling. All, all I've right. been doing is rolling that die. I thought you were, but somebody says you're not. I've been doing my abilities. They're just not, like this one is just roll twice if mm. I get mm. rodents, which I didn't either times. I might have forgotten to activate this bird once. I should maybe have one extra egg, but it's fine. It's I'm not the end of the world for uh, me. I can. I'm going to lay eggs. I'm going to pay a resource so I can lay a total of five eggs. Wow, that's a lot of eggs. It's the last round. I don't have very many eggs out. Um, it is the last round. I don't have... Ooh, nope. None of the type of bird nests I need. I have one rando. So I'm going to go ahead and do all of them right here just for ease and then i can tuck a card from my hand to draw a card i don't really know what the benefit of that other is than i want to but tuck tucking, a card tucking a card is a point so yeah, that's so definitely i'm just a not even going to worry about drawing and yeah, then i, don't like I get to I'm, look at the top of the deck if it's 25 or 75 or less it is oh my gosh tuck. yeah i think i'm going to get destroyed here i don't think you are well it might be you've close. got a lot more birds out than i do i do all have right. more birds out but they're not <laughs> they're not all high scoring birds so Cool. All right, so that's the end of that, right? So yes. now we have to score the game. So I'm going to slide this down a little bit so I can put the scoring pad right here. So we've got, how about I just use an R for myself and a K for you. So let's okay. count up the total point values from all of our birds. I like how you didn't use the last two spaces and my already being used score pad. I didn't want to, I mean, I wanted it to look nice and fresh for the stream. It does. They can see it really well. All right, so count up our birds. I only had 26 points in birds, so that's not a lot. 28. See, so we were pretty close with birds. I did not have you with birds. All right, bonus cards. I have two. My first one, birds with this little colored nest. I've got one, two, three, four of them. That's four points. And this one is birds that have at least one egg laid on them. I have nine. All right, so... That's six points. So I got 10 points for my bonus cards. My first one is the passerine specialist, birds with wingspans of 30 centimeters or less. I have one two, three, four of those, so that's three points. Okay. And then I get birds that can only live here, so there are three of those, and I will get another three points. So that's six points? Six points. Not the best on bonus cards All right, cards end there. of round goals. I got four, five, six. Oh, we didn't do the last round bonus scoring. Oh. Who had the most eggs in these little... I had one. I also had one. Okay, so we tied. So actually we tied, so that, just, <laughs> that wiped itself out. Okay. So... I ended up with um, four, five, six, 12, plus seven, 19 points for me. End of round goals for Kira, five plus six is 11, uh, plus seven is 18. Look at that, only one point difference. Ooh. So here's where we're getting uh, eggs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine for me. Eight. Eight for you. Food on cards, I had one, two, three, four. I have zero. Yeah, tucked cards, I have zero. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Six for you, so that's huge. It is. So I have... Did I beat him? That's the question. 68, it looks like. Did I ruin... I'm doing that correct. Did he ruin his... Or did he break his streak? Or... Maybe. Or math. All right, yeah, math is hard, right? 12 plus 8 is 20, 28. I think you've got me. If I could do math live on a stream. Do you want me to get out the calculator? No, it's okay. Fine. Nope, actually 66 to 68. Oh, you won finally! Two points! My first game of Wingspan I've ever won in my life. Good job! Wow, that was ridiculously close. It was. And math. Math. You can double check the math. Everyone at home can double check the math. Let's You've make sure I did that two. right. I've got you by four, so that's a difference of two. Oh, that's you're, a difference we're doing of that one. one. Difference of two, difference of two. Did I do my math right? You did your math wrong. What? I'm gonna double check. Hold on. Uh oh, we're going you, to the You you talk. Here. You talk to folks and you I want you to go to the talk screen while I do I this. I might have done the math wrong. It's hard to do math live. I'm not gonna lie. It's really hard, but I'm gonna pull it up. Why don't you Well everybody that everybody's watching, they're they're counting up at home, right? Oh I hope so. Uh let's see, Ryan. I'm gonna just get you in here. I have a calculator. I'm doing it. I got it, I got it. We so both Kira have calculators. If you think my math is so poor. Plus six plus eighteen. Let's find out. Let's bring it to the thing. <laughs> eight plus six. Twenty eight plus eighteen plus eight plus I'm six. Sixty eight. Right? Yep. For me. 
66, yeah, then yeah. you're good. My math was correct. Look at that. You put me all that pressure. I was like sweating. Didn't I do my math correctly? I uh, wasn't sure. I just like to give you a hard time, Ryan. Come on, Two we points. all know this. That's close. That's, That's a super close game. Well, here, I'm going to pull us back to the um, the main screen. Good. So let's pull. Let's go back over here, and we can talk about the experience a little bit because okay. let's talk about that outcome, by the way. <laughs> Two points different, completely different engines. I mean, I was going heavy on eggs. You were going heavy on, on tucking cards and things like yeah. that. Like, I feel like we played, like, even our opening strategies were very different. Yeah. And it came out to two points. I mean, it was, for me, I wasn't getting the cards I needed <clears> for <throat> the goals that I had. So it was kind of like, if the goals work out, cool. Because those goals only really are, the goals are pretty low scoring for the most part for the low end. Yeah. So it's like, if it works out, great. If I focus too hard on that, it tends to be when I lose. So this is a lower scoring game for me, I think. It's a lower scoring normally game I'm in, the in 70s. general. Yeah. But this is actually pretty average for me. I just normally get beat by people that are in the 70s or higher. Yeah, yeah. So I got lucky. I had, what screwed me the really, most was really bright on this I would have only it. lost by one point if I had paid attention to the first goal, which was to have eggs in forests, not birds in forests, which is what I was going for. So the first goal I got was to get birds with this. I don't know what all these nest names are. The little, these nests right uh, that I had at the start of the game, but I didn't realize they were both forests. Both of the birds I grabbed to complete my objective were both forests. So I, I got a lot of food early, but I yeah. really, it took me a while. I never really got a lot of that wetlands going. Yeah. So it was hard to draw cards. Well, the wetlands, yeah, the wetlands helps with cards. But yeah. I find that, like, it's one of those things. You're either like, ah, oh, crud, I didn't get far enough in food. I'm not getting enough food resources. Or I need to lay more eggs. Like, I kind of am thinking here, I would have rather than put down another bird, maybe just have laid the eggs, you know? Well, we and, have you know, a wing expansion possibly wing coming expansion. out. So, so we will... We will have to just play again, but I love this game. Yeah, if 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 the if the, whenever the expansion comes out, we'll probably come back to this one. We might even come back to this one anyway because it's just a fun one to play. So yeah. we'll see, but not next week. Next week we're doing something a little different. We're doing Fine Sand from Stronghold Free, Games. From Stronghold yeah. Games, and this is a Friedman Freeze game. If you're not familiar with Friedman Freeze, all of his games start with an F. They really do. Yeah, it's very interesting. But this is cool because it uses the fabled fruit. Yeah, game, game system with two apps in there. With, with Fs. But they use the, that system in here, so you can play the game as it is, or you can in, inject the, the fabled cards into it. That's fun. We might, um, maybe we, we'll look I've into soloed it. We the game a couple little. times. Um, I've played it two-player a couple times. So it's a, it's a cute game. It's a yeah, deck we'll, deconstruction we'll, game. We'll play with it a little bit and see what kind of cool yeah. things we want to bring in, because we also have fabled fruit, so we can, you know, so, we yeah. can see so how that here's works all the. Oh, you're showing off the birdhouses again? Look at that. Those amazing pieces you can so get. so cute. And so, but let's not forget the most important thing, other than the fact that we are giving away a copy of Wingspan today, which I know yeah. has got probably gonna... lots of people hype. But I'm going to also show you these lovely nests from Top Shelf Gamer. They sent these along for us to have and play with, and they are donating these and a set of sleeves for the game to go with the copy we'll be sending to the winner. Yeah, these nests are one of the coolest components. Yep. They like they feel like real bird nests. They're so cool. And so, and then on the top of it, we've been playing on our wonderful table from Game Toppers. Yeah, thank our sponsor. you again to Game Toppers for um, everything they've done. Lots of really cool things going on uh, in this game. Lots of really. I'm sure there'll be more and more custom components for this game as time goes on, but that is Wingspan. That's Wingspan. Thank you guys for watching, for commenting, and uh, one of you is going to win, so pay attention. We'll announce that here sometime today. So thank you guys, and we'll see you next week.